Boy, I sure do love breaking news. News, <laughs> finding out who's going to play what hero, what's going to happen, and, and when it's going to happen. I reckon we should tell. <laughs> I think we should. Another edition of Talk Nerdy to Me here at the Alamo Draft House. El Paso Montesio starts. I'm starting now. This starts now. <laughs> What game that you get on? Is it card or Eve? What kind of class do you play, girl? In an RPG? Cause I know what them elf girls need from WoW to end. So, call them what you will. Captain Marvel. Shazam. Just Shazam now. Just Shazam, right? No, Bill, yeah. Billy Batson. Lots little, of lawsuits. Little boy. Little, little teenage boy. Granted the powers of the wizard Shazam. I don't know why I'm still doing this in this sort of accent. <laughs> You're going all <laughs> Jeff Bridges on me. <laughs> I don't know where Tell you what. Tell you what. Um, you sit down here and I'll tell you the story. <laughs> we finally got uh, a little bit of it in the know as to who's going to be playing the uh, the hero, Shazam. A yeah. little, little surprised at this casting, actually. Yeah, and I like it, though. I like it because they went with an unknown. They went with a dude that's not, uh, you know, I don't know too big, too big. I don't know about big. unknown. We're not talking about, like, mega star, huge, boom. It's all bright lights. <laughs> no, no, no. We finally got to find out who's going to be playing. He's a good actor. Shazam. I'll give yeah. you that. He's a good actor. Uh, he, uh... Better start going to the gym. Yeah, he doesn't have the Shazam physique. He better start going to the gym. Because if he's going to beat Black Adam, who's going to be portrayed by Dwayne, Dwayne Johnson, Johnson, The Rock, <laughs> he needs to smell what he's cooking. He needs to start uh, bulking up. He needs yeah. to start getting on that optimum nutrition, you know, <laughs> whey, mass gainer, gainer. mass gainer. You need to look up Joe Weider. Okay, who is it? Zachary Levy. Zachary Levy, all right? Yep. Uh, you may remember him from such shows as, uh, what, Chuck? Chuck. And I know I'm missing something here, something that, uh, that he you was like. In, uh, he's in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. Mm-hmm. There's another guy that we use in Marvel DC. Yeah. I just realized that. He's jumping ship. He's jumping yeah, ship he over. He Fandral? Mm-hmm. Jumping yeah, the Warriors 3. Yeah. Jumping ship over into uh, the DCU. I like the choice. I like it. I think... Um, uh, he has this wholesomeness, this this really the Billy inno- Batson side of it. Yeah, this wholesomeness, this innocent vibe to him that really he can throw down if he wanted to. So I, I like this choice. I, I I love at first seeing just fanboys lose their lunch over a cast, over a casting that they don't agree with. It happened with Michael Keaton. Look what happened. Oh yeah. They- it happened with Heath Ledger. Yeah. Look what happened. You were wrong on both times. People, you know, eating crow. I love it. When, when when fanboys eat crow, and now you can screenshot that noise. Now you can, like, call them out on, well, oh, you didn't say that. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, well, right. why, don't we, why don't we look at the videotape from 2017? <laughs> <laughs> Let me check out the tape. <laughs> we check that out, man. I think he's going to do a great job. He's got the chops mm-hmm. for the acting part, but I guess if they make Chris Evans look like a scrawny little dude on the Captain yeah. America movie, yeah, yeah. they should be able, if he can't buff up, they should be able to... Shazam him. Here's the thing, man. You're getting paid to do this role. Dude, they're going to pay you to buff up. Okay? You're, they're going to pay you to go see a trainer. Personal they're, trainer. They're going to pay the right you to take all the right uh, supplements. They're going to pay you to go to the gym. Because this dude is going to get paid. <laughs> because if this is successful, oh, he going to well, get paid again. Back in the day, Shazam was bigger than Superman. Yeah, he was so... He, yeah, Captain he was, Marvel, Shazam, was so big that you know DC filed a lawsuit... Uh, mm-hmm. with, with the comic books, and so... Fawcett. Yeah. With comics. Fawcett, yeah. and so eventually, you know, Fawcett went under the uh, DC umbrella. And so Captain Marvel, Shazam, uh, was given yeah. a backseat to Superman. And then they couldn't call it Captain Marvel anymore because, yeah. well, timely became Marvel Comics. Right, right. And so, you know... Cease and desist. And, and so Captain Marvel went by that name for uh, X amount of years before, before Mar- well, when Marvel finally uh, becoming the big powerhouse movie studio that it is, uh, finally said, hey, you know, let's... That's, that's our name. That's our name, yeah. So yeah, now he, Captain Marvel now just goes by Shazam. Shazam. So basically, we're all over the place here with this story. <laughs> so basically, if you don't know, that's okay. I'm not, we're not one of those dudes that, uh, you know, if you don't know the backstory of uh, Captain Marvel, 
Uh, we're not going to crucify you for that. Uh, Billy Batson is this orphan teenager who has beso bestowed the power of the wizard Shazam, the wisdom of Solomon, strength of Hercules, stamina of Atlas, the wisdom of Zeus, the right. speed of Achilles, and no, uh, the, the, the courage of Achilles, and the speed of Mercury. Yes. Did, did I get it? I, I think you nailed it. Bam! Better than I could have done. Damn. Now, now, if you want to ask me the, uh, the, the powers that Black Adam got, because they're all Egyptian gods. Yeah. Uh, the Sheru, uh, Mehen, Haru, Murato, <laughs> uh, <Murado>, Mito. <laughs> Kato, Murata. And it'll come to me. I actually have to stop and think about that. Yeah. But he's got all these, all these great powers, and it makes him the Earth's mightiest mortal. And again, he has this really cool dynamic because it's this kid. At the heart of the story, it's this kid who wants to do good, that he is so good that the wizard chose him to be his, you know, not his avatar. Heir. Yeah, his, yeah, it's, yeah, yeah, you could say his heir. The, heir apparent. Yeah. And, and the wizard saw something great. He saw something phenomenal. He saw something good at the core of Billy's heart to give him all these powers and to be his champion for good. And uh, to see this uh, on the big screen, I think it's going to be awesome, man. I, I'm looking forward to it because like, Shazam's... Hugely popular when it first came out. Then he kind of fell into disuse. Yeah. We're going back to 1940 uh, here. Oh, yeah. yeah way, way, way you know. back. And uh, I just, I would love to see Shazam make it back. And mm -hmm. who doesn't want to see The Rock as a superhero, finally? Anti-hero. Mm. Yeah, yeah. Villain, yeah, anti-hero. Yeah, yeah. Actually, yeah. villain, I guess. Yeah. But who doesn't want to see The Rock in a superhero movie? Oh, yeah. Sure. I, that's long overdue. And I think that this Batista is... Batista beat him. Yeah, Batista is. That's he's in another class right now, man. But uh, I think this is uh, tailor made for for uh, Dwayne Johnson because you know he's had experience, you know, playing an Egyptian character, <laughs> playing you know, not very well. But what? now that his acting chops have gotten a little bit better, <laughs> this isn't Scorpion King. Yeah, there is ain't no Scorpion but King. Black Adam's kind of a. He's one of those almost likable villains. Yeah. So I didn't mean you to spit, spit right on me. I'm just so excited, man. Oh, my Rock's God. Rock's going to be in a movie. Good job, Sylvester. <laughs> Stop, friends. I got that. <laughs> You're despicable. <laughs> so, yeah, I, I, I can't wait to see. And I, if Zachary mm -hmm. Levi... Uh, if he bulks up, man. If they make him a believable he Shazam... He will. Uh, the, he's got the acting yeah, part yeah, down. Yeah. I mean, so. if they made they made Henry Cavill, I mean, they, dude, they, he got yoked out of his mind when he was... He was a huge dude to start with. Yeah. I mean, he got yoked when he was cast as Superman. So they'll do the same thing. If DC does anything right, man, they know uh, how to they know how to cast. And so I think he'll grow into this role. So with that said, check out the details coming up. Uh, it's going to be what? Uh, 2019. Tw April of 2019. Yeah. Ooh, that's a ways that's, to go. Uh, that's a ways to go. Will that be in the cinematic universe? Will that be in the DC Cinematic universe? I, I don't. I think they they're kind of. I don't even think they need it. The cinematic universe is not going to rely on each other. You, you don't even think you need a cinematic universe anymore. Man. I just want to see this. Just break movie. away from that Marvel formula. Be your own self. Be be whatever. Let's hear those fanboys cry. But anyway, we'll check it out. I want to see that. Zachary Levi. Well, Shazam. So mark it on your calendar. Twenty nineteen. Twenty nineteen. You can check it out here at the Alamo Draft House. Yeah, we're, we're going to. We'll see you in two years. <laughs> Sitting right here. Sitting right here. A little longer beard. <laughs> A little longer beard for the <laughs> both of us. So here at the Alamo Draft House in El Paso, I'm about to see you. Waiting. We're going to be here the whole time. We're just going to be waiting the entire time. <laughs> Come on. For the film Shazam. <laughs> you can catch us on all social media. All. Maybe even MySpace. We're not sure. So. Is that a you, thing? Yeah. Is MySpace still a thing? <laughs> you can find us. If you ain't looking, if you ain't trying, if you don't find us, you don't find us. You ain't looking. You ain't trying. <laughs> I need to try and say that a little bit better. We're on the interwebs. All right. Big thanks to Raywork Productions, by the way, for filming us. Big thanks to the Alamo Draft House, letting us film here in their gorgeous theater, voted best theater in El Paso. I'm Jack right, Lutz. So. I'm Jack Lutz. Troy Stegner. Good night. Sleep tight. What game that you get on Is it card or Eve? What kind of class do you play, girl? In an RPG 
Cause I know what them elf girls need From wow to end